Christian Prince, maybe uh, uh, if you can uh, explain to the people in the in the chat about uh, the poetry of uh, Amrul Qais. It's yeah. really interesting, uh, that topic. Maybe you can show them also, if you Google it, you can find a picture yeah. exactly uh, from uh, the text of Amr al-Qais, right. which, uh, who was a couple uh, hundred years before Islam and before Muhammad. And, you, and Muhammad took it copy-paste, exactly the same poetry of Amr al-Qais, and he put it in the Quran about... Uh, you know, you know all these uh, ayahs, right? Yeah, right? And I believe there are four ayahs or something many. But, uh, that Muhammad, yeah, many, but at least four, and he copy pasted it. And he, my friend, it's in a my, copy paste religion. Book, right? In my book, Quran and Science, I have tons of those things, not only from Member of Qais, from many books, because Muhammad was copying from many. Yeah, yeah. from the but this Sanhedrin, is, but, but Mishnah, this is the, this is the poetry, this is the poetry. Oh. <clears throat> and you know, the poetry is very beautiful, actually. <clears throat> yeah. Muhammad he copied from it. This is why he, he took it. This is about yeah, the same yeah. about the moon That's state. true. Yeah, hmm. yeah. Because uh, when when uh, Amr al Qais he is talking about uh, the splitting of the moon, he is talking about uh, uh, love love between him and and a woman. Yeah. How the suddenly <laughs> uh, a poetry about the love of a woman bet between a, a husband and his wife became a splitting the moon? Actually, splitting the moon. Yeah. You know, you see, you see people guys, don't know that. <clears throat> Yeah, you see, guys, I'm losing my voice. You see the poetry. This is the poetry in front of me. Muhammad, he copied. Let me show you the part he copied. That is Sa'a wa Shaq al Qamar. Here. Yes, that one. Let me highlight. Um, okay. So he copied this part from the poetry. And then Na'ish al Tarfi ba'inihi. He copied that part. Faramani fata'ata fa'aqar. He copied that part. Fatarakni ka Hashim al Muhtadar. Copy this part. Uh, then, Ayat al Akmar Yisra fi Duja here into this part. And and Nurukum Shay on Zahar, Zahar, this part. And then yeah. he continued. I mean, he is copying is exactly word by word. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Min hab, min hab this, is, this is a love story. <laughs> yeah. It's a love story between a man and, and his wife. And we know we know about the history of Amr al Qais, uh, Christian Prince. He was like uh, the Romeo, basically the Casanova of his time. He yeah. was writing poetry, and he was loved by many women in in his lifetime. You know, he was, he was like uh, he was like Hugh Hefner, right? He, anyway, but you know, at that time, you know, <laughs> uh, uh, and by the way, he was supposedly Christian too. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So he's a well-known guy, right? <laughs> yeah, but but uh, but that at that time. You know, uh, poetry for women, it was very, I mean, th th those are desert people. They have nothing to do except poetry. They speak poetry. Yes. They don't yeah. even talk language. They, you know, they speak to each other at poetry. You know? Yeah. So when yeah, and, and, and yeah, and, and that's why, that's why the people who knew about this poetry that Muhammad stole, this is why they are everyone in the Quran. They are telling to Muhammad, you're nothing but a scam. You are stealing uh, uh, f from things that were that are already known. Yeah. So people who knew, who could write and read, they knew about this poetry. But you know, a lot of people illiterate, actually illiterate in the desert, they cannot uh, write, write and read. So they believe Muhammad. Yeah. Well, we are here to expose it. What we can do? Yeah. It's uh, you know, Islam is uh, made by illiterate, so-called illiterate, but. We know he could write and read very well, but it's made for illiterate people who follow a blind, blind religion, blind political I ideology, basically. Uh, it's it's not easy to say to yourself, "I was a fool all my life, following a following a liar." Yeah.